Hey peeps, welcome to the Crafty Witch UK. My name is Arietta and today I have an unbagging for you from Spell Queen. Um, many of you will know that I have um, worked with Spell Queen before. They have been really supportive of this channel. I mentioned to Spell Queen that I was very keen to take part in some festive events and we discussed me um, choosing a canvas and being able to showcase that throughout the festive period. So this is what I've chosen. Let me get it out and I'll show you. Oh. Right. Okay, so um, first things first, obviously Spell Queen canvases, um, they come in boxes um, and then canvases are also packed in these lovely little canvas um, drawstring bags which are great for storing your canvases, keeping the dust off um, and there are quite a few uses for these if you want to store things in them after the fact. So um, we will look at the toolkit and things in a tick because I know most of us have already got toolkits so it's less important so I actually don't know what size this is believe it oh. okay so um the canvas is a slightly flocked felty kind of back um very soft pliable canvas it's got a seared edge Oops, my hand there so you can see um, it's a scalloped and seared edged so that won't, um, you won't have any problems with fraying. Oh, that is a big pack of drills. Okay. Whew. Right, we'll look at the drills in a minute. So let's get this canvas on show. If I can manage to show you the whole thing. It's huge. So this beauty. Let me see if I can come out a little bit. There we go got more of it there so this is my holly king green man um he is 37 colors in square with four ab's um so yeah i am really excited to get working on him um is listed as 50 by 70 i will check that for you um to see if that is true to size. Let's just... oh. Right, so it's indeed 50 by 70. It is 50 that way, so I would expect it to be 70 this way. Yeah, 50 by 70 is the printed area on the canvas. So if you are looking for frames or mattings for it, then um, you know that the size that they're listing is the size of the printed area. Um, oh, he's just so lovely. Um, the canvas, let me just, I'll bring you down for a bit of a detailed look. Bear with me. Okay, so there you can see how clear the canvas is. Really, really easy to read. Um, it is a mixture of alphanumeric and then a few symbols thrown in for good measure. Let's just have a look at the... Uh, so yeah, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've got play button, arrow, LV, question mark, anchor, E, U, F, M, C equals P, funny little arrow thing, O, R, J, T, Y, N, star, Z, K, plus, dot, another little arrow, A, and 
Arctic. Um, so, and it's these last four. These are our ABs, as you can see there. So we've got the um, the 5200, which is a white. Um, we've got a uh, 963, which is a little pinky color. Uh, 818 and then the 606 which is a red and that is going to go into that's this dot symbol and that's so that's going to go in all the holly berries they're going to be so sparkly um so it is a poured glue canvas um i have never had a problem with a spell queen canvas they have always been really nice to work on um they are very good value for money. Um, let me move you out a bit and then we can look at the drills. Okay, so our drills come. This is a bit crinkly, I'm afraid. I will crinkle as quickly as possible. So our drills come pre-baggied and in numbered baggies. Um, which is very nice indeed. Um, so you can see there, we've got our, these are our ABs. So yeah, we've got the two shades of pink and then we've got a white and then this lovely red color that's gonna go into those holly berries. So those are separate. Um, the canvas, is available in rounds, squares, um, squares with ABs or round crystal. Um, so there's lots of options and that means that you can take, if you wanted this image, you can sort of tailor it to meet your price bracket. Um, at this size, 50 by 70 square with ABs is 50 seven, sorry, $57.99. Um, if you were to go for rounds, it is a little cheaper, comes out at $54.99 for the same size, but you could also go down to a smaller size in rounds um, or squares, and it would then be, yeah, so round or square at 25 by 35 centimeters pretty small um, that comes out at 22 99 uh, if you want it with crystals it's only available in the larger size at 57 99 so the square AB only in this size round crystals only in this size at the higher price and then if you want to save yourself some pennies go for a smaller version but obviously you will then be compromising a little bit on the render if you go smaller um, for an image like this, um, you want to get that detail in the face, um, particularly. I think that I would be concerned going smaller that the eyes, um, because they're quite small anyway, I would think that you would lose some definition there. And I want to be able to see all the different leaves and things. Um, so yeah, we've got all of our colors. I'm not going to go through all the colours, but you can see them there, all very lovely. Um, and certainly from what I have seen, there doesn't look to be any obvious problems with the drills. Um, the backs look pretty flat. The I haven't noticed any tabs. I'm sure that not every drill is going to be perfect, but not every drill is ever perfect. However, I think... Um, these look pretty good. I've just seen the 310. Is that 310? That is indeed 310. Yes, we've got, we've got two bags of 310 in here. Um, and yeah, they are looking pretty good. I'm going to stick them in a tray and see how they hold up. So, as we're here, we'll look at the kit. Let's move the drills off to one side. Um, Spell Queen kits, um, you will only get one kit, um, even if you order multiple paintings. However, you can request another kit, but um, 
the assumption is that you would need one kit, even if you're doing three paintings. Um, their kits are very lovely. You get a large tray. Um, you get a standard diamond painting pen. Uh, it is clear with sparkles. This has a three placer and a single placer and comes with a pink squishy, which, oh, I can't get on, but it will fit. Um, we get some washi tape. We've got star-shaped wax, um, three plates of, in a little caddy, which is very nice. Um, we get a little extra storage container. This is, I think, too small to be useful for your actual drills. I tend to use mine for storage of special shapes. I've got one that's got my spare tips in for pens. Um, so yeah, there are uses for these, um, even if they might not seem to be useful when you first look at it. Um, so, But it's a nice additional thing. And then you get a nice set of uh, metal tweezers. These ones are not hugely sharp, but they would still hurt if you were to you know, poke yourself with them. Um, but yeah, those are quite nice there. Um, right, so let's have a look at these drills. Let's pop a few in there, hope for the best. Uh, well, they're not staticky, so that's quite good. Um, So there we go, you can see there, uh, we've got uniform sizes. I've not lined them up very well, unfortunately, but um, <laughs> yeah, everything looks nice and square. There's no obvious um, tabs on anything that I can see. I've just spilled them. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I think that's, that's all looking rather lovely. I will pop those away. So, what else do I need to tell you about this? Um, okay, so um, just to finish off, um, it is worth um, noting that I do have a code for you. Should you wish to shop at Spell Queen, you can say 15% um, using my code code um i may get a little kickback from that um but it doesn't cost you any extra um you are saving 15 percent um using my code which i will pop up on the screen but also all of my discount codes and affiliate links um, are always in the crafty code section in the description for my videos so this is going to be my canvas now for up to snow good um, an event which has already started um, but runs all the way through to January so um, yeah <laughs> wish me luck <laughs> I'm gonna try and get as much of this done as possible um, and I will try and share progress as we go along um, so I'm currently working on a um, Doctor Who canvas for the Doctor Who event I'm working on a diamond art studio canvas for their purple post event and now I'm going to be doing this for Up to Snow Good which is the diamond painting fanatics event. Um, you can follow all of my updates and progress on my Instagram page as well as if you check out um, any of my posts on Facebook or Twitter or just by inputting the hashtag for whatever event is that you're interested in and you'll be able to find everybody's progress for that event if they've shared it. Um, so all that remains to be said now is that if you have enjoyed watching this, if you want to find out more about me and about diamond painting and other craft projects, then please do consider hitting that like button, subscribe, become a member of the Crafty Coven, and I will see you in the next video. Stay crafty!